Yes. Oh, yes. Hi there. Oh, hi. Brother, there's a lot of things not on my LinkedIn profile. Uh, <laughs> uh, I need extra pages. Ooh, uh, let's see. Uh, well, um, I'm really good with animal impersonations, and that is definitely not on my profile. I can do just about every animal in the world, like like a sheep. <clears throat> Wait, I can't do it right now. One, two. Great, yeah, perfect. Hello, hello, hello. Hi. My first job is not on there. I worked the window at Jack in the Box, and the sound system was so bad that it came out like <sighs> So we used to always say, you know, I was in high school, so we always used to say, smack in the chops, can I take your order, please? That's not on there. I am actually a certified barbecue judge. I am a member of the Kansas City Barbecue Society. I have a name tag, a membership number, and I am certified to judge barbecue competitions in the United States. Uh, so if you have some doubt about your uh, ability to cook uh, ribs, uh, pulled pork, brisket or uh, smoked chicken, I am the man to see. Um, I think the easiest thing is my four and a half year old son. You know, most people don't know that I'm a dad and I love hanging out with my boy. So if you ever hear or see me out there in public and want to talk me up, just talk about Preston and we'll have a good conversation. So the one thing that's not on my LinkedIn profile is my very first job. It was with the Texas Rangers baseball team and I was an usher at. I wore a red gingham shirt and a white cowboy hat and I had feathers that so I had to wear the, the hat kind of back on my head because you know I couldn't mess with the feathers okay. so that's not on my LinkedIn profile. I'm the father of four um, I'm obsessed with college football and I uh, love to do yoga when I have any spare time at all. I wrote an ebook back like right when ebooks were starting to happen and it was called 77 and a half PR tips and it's still for sale on Amazon. I would take it down, but I have no idea how to find the publisher to get it taken down, because I think out of the 77 and a half tips, about 76 and a half are um, no longer relevant because the uh, world has changed so much since then. Like, there's a question, are bloggers journalists? It's so dated, and I would love to have it removed. I was a mascot for a radio station. If you remember the San Diego Chicken, we had a suit made, from the made by the same company I was an orange rooster, and I drove around Fort Myers, Florida, in a in a renovated milk truck, being the rooster, the mascot for a radio station. So I actually have mascot experience in my background. I come from a family of funeral directors, and I worked at a funeral home for parts of about four years, and um, so I have plenty of experience in embalming bodies and plenty of long nights with dead people and uh, it was a fantastic experience. Poor crows, I do a killer crow. Ready for this? Sorry guys. <coughs> <coughs> Anyways, it tends to get attention. I hope I didn't interrupt her videos. Anyways, when I'm in a normal circumstance I can do okay. the entire farm if you want. But yeah, you won't ever see that on my LinkedIn profile. <laughs>